This motion picture contains scenes of graphic violence, which are crucial to the storyline. It is not suitable for viewing by children. trip all the way across the country to see him by train <laughs> and this booklet that he sent pictures, pictures of, private of private sleeping private rooms room. it's just terrific welcome aboard the sunset limited folks my name is jim evans are you the guy who runs the train jack <laughs> <laughs> not exactly i'm in charge of the onboard services order anything you like wow thanks Thanks, Mr. Evans. I'm Susan Peterson. Please call me Susan. Hi, I'm Jim. It's a pleasure having you with us today. Why don't we start right here in this Superliner sleeping car? Let me show you a little bit about your deluxe broom so you can really, really enjoy, enjoy the, ride. the ride. Deluxe bedrooms are designed to comfortably accommodate two adults. Look, Mom, the shower. Oh, Jack, what are you talking about? Come on, Susan. Take a look. Take a look. What's this? That's a partition, Jack. It opens to the next deluxe bedroom. You can make two rooms into one large, one large suite. suite. Like if Dad came next time. You're right, You're Jack. right Jack. And this is our special bedroom. This bedroom is designed to accommodate a passenger and an, and escort. an escort. And the curtain provides privacy inside the room. Why don't we walk ahead to the lounge car? I'll bet you two would like a drink. Sounds good to me. so much. I thought you were only reading books and writing letters in the train. Hey, I've been doing a little exploring, exploring on, my, on own. my own. Just listen to this. Hey, guess who's going to continue along on the last leg of the trip with us? You mean... Mm-hmm. That's great, Jim. Mom, I'm very impressed. Hey, why the gloom look? It's just that, well, the trip's almost over and... And we'll have to say goodbye? Yeah, I guess so. Just think of all the fun you had, not to mention all you learned and taught your mom. Yeah, I guess so. Well, thank you, Jack. Gosh, I... I don't know what to say. That's okay, I understand. I'm glad you had a good time. 